Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do a reading for Libra. This is for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for end of July, okay? This is for the end of July. So what do we have for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? Well, we got one. What do we have for Libra? Let's just get one more. We got two. Oh, well, we got a few. I'm going to take them because I think that I should. So we're going to take these. We got one, two, three, four, five, six. Six is about getting your life back on track. So you may be headed in a new direction. Uh, first card out is dark man dealings or relationship with a man with dark complexion or hair so you're gonna be dealing with a man with dark complexion or dark hair claw be careful do not take risks oh boy that's always fun right tortoise slowly but surely getting ahead February. February is very prominent for you. You could be dealing with somebody that is born in February or the month of February is prominent. February, February would be Aquarius or a Pisces. It doesn't have to be. Um, but this there's a, could be something that started in February that is coming back around at this time. Or things are going to change in February because I noticed the, the mouth is blowing when I just looked at it. It's like that that's like, when you see something like that blowing, it reminds me of the winds of change, so who knows. Um, mm, v, victory in some endeavor, and I put it over here. It's interesting because I never know what I, where I'm going to put the cards. Horseshoe, good luck. So you have, and it's interesting because I put these two over here and I put these other ones over here. I'm going to put good luck over here too. I don't ever know. I just go with my gut. That's how I do my readings, okay? So in the past, we have dark man or relationship with a man with dark complexion or hair. Be careful. Do not take risks. This could be happening right now as well. I think something's going to change in February. I think something is happening now. And maybe they're dealing with somebody that's born in February. Anyhow, horseshoe is good luck. Tortoise, slowly but surely. February, victory in some endeavor. endeavor. So if there's going to be some sort of victory for you. Um, there's going to be some sort of victory. And, and look at this V. Maybe you're dealing with somebody with the name of V that has a V in their name. You never know. So we got a V here. We have victory. Victory. Uh, good luck. Luck is on your side. February is prominent. Very interesting. So let's just see what we got. What do we have for Libra? Mm, you could also be dealing with an Aries. Something to do with Aries or Aries season. This 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 is for the end of July, so there's something to do with an Aries. 7777 seven, seven, seven is a number from heaven. 7 is a number of faith and guidance from above. So I feel like you have some sort of protection here. Heaven. independently owned and operated so you there's some sort of independent you may be becoming a boss maybe you're going to be becoming your own boss typically Aries is a boss so maybe you're going to be taking on that energy Aries is the opposite on on the wheel of you so you probably do have a lot of in common anyhow I do feel like there's some sort of uh being the boss, being in charge. If you think about Aries, which you, you could associate that with the emperor, that is the boss, that is being in charge, uh, taking a leadership position. Some of you may be starting your own business. I have to show you what's on the bottom, just because I do. 
secret admirer. I feel like you have a secret admirer. Maybe that's the Aries. I think for some of you, you're dealing with an Aries or a Pisces or an Aquarius, somebody with the name of with that has a V in their name, and somebody with the dark hair. We're gonna use this deck right here. There's some sort of heaven here. You could also be dealing, but I don't know where this is coming from. But maybe there's a father figure that is in heaven. You know, there's something to do with heaven here. Whenever I see seven, seven is the number from heaven. Seven reminds me of heaven. So I wonder if there is somebody that in heaven that is protecting you because Aries is a protector. Okay, Aries is a protector sign. So I'm not sure if there's some sort of protection from heaven here. It doesn't have to be an Aries. This is, but I just get a message from looking at the cards. I'm, I'm not like any other reader. Anyhow, um, I feel like there is a protection from heaven. Something to do with a father figure, a masculine, whether it's a father or an, or it's a masculine energy. Knight of Pentacles. King of Cups. Six of Pentacles. You're definitely going to be receiving something. You're going to be receiving something. Five of Swords reversed. Ten of Pentacles. Maybe it's money. Maybe it's inheritance. I wonder if there's there's a, or a winning or a bonus or something like that. It feels like you're going to be receiving something. Maybe it's an increase in pay. Um, I feel like you're going to be receiving something. I don't know what this is. Pay, uh, Knight of Pentacles, Ten of Pentacles, Six of Pentacles, all upright. That's very good. It is very, very, very good. And you have good luck on your side. Two of Wands. Death. It is reversed. It feels like we have... we. And we do have a, there's something to do with a father figure. A father is really stick, sticking out to me. Um, so I don't, I don't know what is going on. Or it's a boss. Or you could be dealing with a boss. It could be a boss that is giving you an increase or something like that. You're getting some sort of increase of money, put it that way. Whether you're opening your own business or you're securing a job or you're securing some sort of offer, you're getting an, an inheritance or you're getting an increase of money from somewhere. It may not come till February, but it's coming. Maybe it's going to come now. It could certainly come now. Um, but you've manifested something. The last card out is the Magician card. So you have manifested as above, so below. You're going to get exactly what you asked for. Um, and I can see that you are because you're going to have victory in some endeavor. You're going to be, but it's going to come slow because of that tortoise. So keep doing what you're doing whatever it is because you're going to get some sort of victory okay things are going to change by february you're going to be receiving an offer maybe you receive the offer now you hear about it now and you get your payout in february i don't know if that's the case but something like that we have um the king of cups here that is somebody that is very feeling very uh loving that tends to act on emotions somebody may be expressing their feelings to you um this could be your secret admirer doesn't have to be this could is somebody that has really good intentions that is giving you something um loving okay from their heart this is heartfelt it's a heartfelt gesture right next to the to the right next to the knight of pentacles you are going to be given something from the heart from a person that uh wants to give you something you're gonna be receiving something from somebody you are and it's 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 great it is great um but i do feel like uh I don't know if it comes after an ending. So I don't know if somebody, I mean, I hate to say this, and this will not resonate with everybody, but we have that death card underneath the Ten of Pentacles. Ten of Pentacles can be a family legacy. Death card can be a death. So I don't know if that's the case, but I'm just being honest with you. Anyhow, there could be a change in residence here for some of you, or business, you know, a change in job, a change in position, something like that. Some of you may be changing your position or your location or something like that. Um, I feel like, 
there's a decision that is in the process of being made right now or it's already been made with the two of wands kind of in the past position i feel like that's a decision to uh should i stay should i go being at that crossroad just making the decision but i feel like there's been some sort of delay there's been some sort of betrayal there's because the five of swords unfortunately is above that that's betrayal that's defeat but it's it is reverse so that's choosing you know to walk away from some sort of battle choosing another option maybe you're making that choice choosing to lay a foundation someplace else i wonder if there's been some sort of abuse some sort of verbal abuse mental abuse uh bullying uh uh neglect uh competition even with the five of swords i feel like you've been involved in some sort of hostile situation maybe a family situation but because the ten of pentacles is right in the middle so i don't know if it's a family feud or something like that you could be there this could be the end of a family feud okay things getting better if there's been fighting if there's been hostilities i think that things are going to come to an end i think that things are things are going to get better so i don't know and it could i don't know if it's with this aries or whatever it is i do feel like um a decision is being made to move forward it's done fighting this is the end of a hostile situation with the five of swords reversed this is slowly moving in a new direction with the knight of a pentacles and the tortoise there is an offer that is coming to you that is um from the heart okay just saying you got a heartfelt offer that is coming to you there is somebody around you that is being very kind and generous and is going to be giving you something that you deserve because next to that king of cups is six of pentacles so you're going to be re and next to that king of cups on the other side is the knight of pentacles so you are receiving a something that is going to i don't know if it's going to touch your heart it may it may really touch your heart but whatever it is that whoever's giving you this um is doing it from their heart okay this is somebody that is acting on their feelings and it's, this is a heartfelt gesture and it it appears that what what if this whether this person is giving you their heart or they're giving you money it's abundant okay this is this is in abundance um but that death card reversed is a delay there i feel like there's going to be a delay in you receiving it for some reason the death card reversed it's like an ending but there's a delay in the new beginning okay so there's there's a, there's a delay and i can see that there's a delay okay um, now, next to the Ten of Pentacles is the Six of Swords reversed. Again, that is a delay. It's it's like stuck. Like there's trouble. There's there's waves. There's uh, turbulence. You know, and there's a need to, you know, get away from it. But there's there's something in the way. There's a blockage. There's something that is stopping you from receiving whatever this is okay but you're gonna get it because underneath that six of swords reverse is a magician so that is a yes this is what you asked for this is what you're gonna get okay you're gonna get something you're about to receive something that you manifested um but there is absolutely positively a delay um it has to do with a home or money or family money or um a job you know or increase in money um, a decision is being made. I feel like it's going to go in your favor, but there's some sort of trouble ahead. There's turbulence. There's, 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 there could be problems. There could be problems. And I don't know if it's from somebody that wants to win at all costs that has no moral conscience. I mean, you have, you do have somebody here that likes to fight. Okay. With the five of swords this is somebody who likes to win at all costs, you know, that, that, um, doesn't care who they hurt as long as they win. So I'm not sure who this person is, but you may be in a situation where, you know, you have to, uh, well, this person's trouble by the looks of things. Whoever this person is, they're trouble. They, they're troubled. We get the five of swords reversed and the six of swords reversed. They're in the same lineup. It's a family member. 
It is a family member. It's like somebody that, that you are connected to by relation. Could be a mother-in-law, could be a mother, could be a father, could be, or a family member, could be a child or an aunt or an uncle or somebody like that. Somebody in the family, whether they're married into the family or not, because the Ten of Pentacles here, this is a family situation where there's been hostilities, where there has been some sort of hostilities and there's been a lot of trouble. I feel like there's refusing to take a new approach but you you're going to be gaining some sort of resources you are there's some sort of resources that are coming your way i feel like you have a divine connection because the magician is a divine connection could also be dealing with a gemini you have gemini you have pisces cancer scorpio taurus virgo capricorn um you have scorpio a couple times but taurus virgo capricorn as well you have aries Pisces, Aquarius, um, refusing to take a new approach. We have somebody here that is refusing to take a new approach. They are extremely stubborn. They like to fight. They like to win at all costs. I feel like this person is losing. Whatever they're losing, they're losing. They're losing. Two of Two of Wands is sudden, could be a sudden departure. Right next to that death card, I'm, I'm wondering if there's some sudden ending. Somebody's becoming independently owned and operated. There is independence here. After they have been stuck in a situation that they could not get out of. With that Six of Swords reversed. You're about to receive something that you asked for. Six of Pentacles, Magician underneath it. That is, that is, yes, as above, so below. This is what you deserve. This is balance. Action is going to be taken. It's going to go in your favor. This is going to help to move you forward. I mean, if you've been in financial trouble, you're not going to be forever. This is, this is definitely some sort of, I don't know if it's a windfall or what it is, but you're good. And it may not come till February. You're going to be receiving some sort of money. It has to do with this man with dark hair. If it's not money, it's, it's stability. Okay. It's a stable, solid offer. It's something that you have asked for. If it's not money per se, it's something that you have asked for. This is the end of battling. It is the end of fighting with the Five of Swords reverse. We may have somebody that's just making a decision to be happy. They're, they're sick of the fighting. They're sick of it. You know, the Five of Swords is upright. Upright is engaging in the battle. It's like, I don't care. I don't care. There's somebody that has no moral conscience. In reverse, it can be extremes, but it can also be, you know what? I just want to be happy. I really don't care. You know, so we may have somebody here that is making a sudden choice to just walk away from somebody that has been abusing them. You know, there's abuse here. The Five of Swords is abuse. And it feels like the, if that's the case, they're, they're going to be giving something to you. There could also be, um, with the Five of Swords reversed, and the Six of Swords, somebody getting stopped. They're getting stopped from doing whatever. They're stopping. The Six of Swords reversed. It's not. It's stopping. Okay. It's not going. It's stopping. Something is coming to a stop. This fight, this battle is coming to an end, whatever it is. And Europe, and the Ten of Pentacles is comfort. It is a comfortable home. It is comfortable business life. Life. It's, it's, it's comfort. You're going to be getting some sort of, and if it's, it's like material comfort, okay? It's really going to touch your heart, whatever it is. Um, but it could come after an ending, so I'm not sure what's going on here. There's an ending that leads to a delayed, unfortunately, new beginning. 
because things happen slow. It's not overnight. You don't get this you don't get this money or you don't get this payout. It could be insurance. I don't know. You don't get this payout overnight. Do not spend your money. Hold on to your money. I'm just saying be careful. Do not take risks. But that's next to this man. You got this dark man, which is de dealings or relationship with a man with dark complexion or hair. And next to it is the claw. Be careful. Do not take risks. There, you, there could be a man here that, uh, I don't know if they're getting in trouble, because the, the Six of Swords reversed is trouble. Is trouble. I don't know if there's a man here that is getting, themse getting themselves in trouble. I don't know if it's with a, I feel like it's a water sign. There could, with this Five of Swords reversed, there could also be some crime that is exposed. You know, and crime can be, doesn't, it can be many different things. Okay, uh, there could be something that is exposed. Um, somehow you, you, you reap some sort of rewards from it. Um, there is going to be a decision that is made. We have somebody here that is at a crossroads in their life and they're about to step into new territory very suddenly. It's extremely suddenly. We may even have somebody who just can't hold on anymore with the death card reverse. They've held on. They've held on to this old life or whatever. They've held on to this life that it, 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 it's just over with. You know, they can't do it anymore. It's, it's, there's too much. It's too much. It's too much. They're following their heart. The King of Cups, typically, whoever, whether, whoever it is, it could be you. Somebody is following their heart. They have been reluctant to do so. But now they want balance in their life. They they want what they deserve. They're going after what they deserve. You are definitely going to be receiving something. But you're going to be, and, and I think that you're dealing with somebody that is willing to take action at this point. I feel like there's somebody that is is willing to do whatever it takes to, uh, whether it's you or whoever you're dealing with, the magician is willing, is taking action to bring success. So there's somebody here that is about to take action. They're about to do something. Get prepared for a show as well. You are going to see an increase in resources. You don't expect it. It comes after an unexpected ending. Whatever this unexpected ending is, it may make you emotional while it's happening, but there's a payout at the end. And that's what I got. Good luck.